Hello everybody, my name is Vinay Jacob John. Please visit my two websites jesusheelsministries.org and also prayintongues.org. Today we are going to read about marriage in the Bible, in the Holy Bible, the Old Testament of the Holy Bible, the book of Isaiah chapter 54, verse 5. For our Maker, Jehovah Jireh, our Provider, Jesus Christ, of Nazareth, Holy Spirit, is our husband. The Lord of hosts, Jehovah, is your name, Jesus, and our Redeemer from sin and spiritual death, the Holy One of Israel, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. The God of the whole earth shall you be called Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit. Verse 6. For the Lord God Jehovah has called us as a woman forsaken and green in spirit and a wife of youth when we were refused, says our Lord God Jehovah. Verse 7. For a small moment have I, Jehovah, forsaken thee, Jesus, on the cross, in the tomb, and in hell. But with great mercies will I, Jehovah, gather thee, Jesus, and all people in Jesus Christ's Nazareth. Verse 8. In a little wrath I, Jehovah, hid my face from you, Jesus, for a moment. Jesus on the cross, in the tomb, and in hell below. But with everlasting kindness, I, Jehovah, will have mercy on you, Jesus, says the Lord our God, our Redeemer, Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit. Also, let's turn to the book of Malachi, chapter 2, verse 14. The Lord God, Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit, has been witness between thee and the wife of thy youth, against whom thou hast dealt treacherously. She is, the, she is your companion and the wife of your covenant. Verse 15. And did not Jehovah make one, yet had he the residue of the Spirit, and wherefore one, that Jehovah might seek a godly seed? Therefore take heed to your spirit, and let none deal treacherously against the wife of his youth. Verse 16, For the Lord Jehovah, the God of Israel, Jesus' Holy Spirit, says that I hate putting away or divorce. For one covereth violence with his garment, saith the Lord of hosts, Jehovah. Therefore take heed to your spirit, that ye deal not treacherously with the wife of your youth. Also, in the New Testament of the Holy Bible, Ephesians chapter 5, verse 25. Husbands, love your wives, even as Christ Jesus of Nazareth also loved the church, all of us here on this planet earth, in heaven above, and those who are in hell below. And you, Jesus, you gave yourself for us all on the cross, in the tomb, and in hell below. Verse 26, that you, Jesus, might sanctify us and cleanse us all with the washing of the water by the word of our living God, Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit. The Bible says, man shall not live by natural bread alone, but by every spiritual word that comes out of the mouth of our Lord God, Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit. We shall be filled indeed, because Jesus likes to feed us all his people with the word of Jehovah, Jesus, the Holy Spirit. Verse 27, that you, Jesus, will present us all to yourself a glorious church, not having spot or wrinkle or any such thing, but that it, we should be holy and without blemish or without sin. Verse 30, For we all are your members, the members of your body, Jesus, members of your flesh, Jesus, and members of your bones, Jesus. Verse 31, For this cause shall a man leave father and mother, and shall be joined unto his wife, and they too shall be one flesh. Verse 32, This is a great mystery, but I, Father, Saint, Apostle Paul, speak concerning Christ Jesus of marriage, Christ Jesus of Nazareth and the Church. We are the Church of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. All of us here on this planet earth and those in heaven above and those who are in heaven below. 
Also, let's turn to the book of Hebrews, chapter 13, verse 4. Marriage is honorable in all people, and the bread undefiled are kept pure. But homongers and adulterers, God, Allah, or Jehovah will judge. Thank you, everybody, for listening to me today. I'm Vinay Jacob John. Please visit my friend's website, Jesse Duplantis Ministry, Ministries, my friend and partner in the Gospel of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Jesse Duplantis Ministries, www.jdm.org, and also Christians United for Israel, cufi.org. Please also visit my two websites, Jesus Heals Ministries.org, and also PrayInTongues.org Jesus loves us all, Jesus heals us all, Jesus provides for us all, always, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Amen.